Hi, Porter families. Amy Condon here. Today, I'm going to show you how to log into Clever from a phone. So if your phone is your only access point at home today, you can still get logged into Clever and have your child be connected to their teacher. Um, in order to get to Clever on your phone, there's a couple of things that you have to do. The first thing is download Google Chrome. Once you download Google Chrome, you're going to type in this web address, which is bit.ly, B-I-T dot L-Y forward slash S-C-S-D Clever bit.ly forward slash SESD cover. Once you're here, it's going to take you to a web page on your phone that looks like this. This page should look pretty familiar to your students. Um, you're going to go ahead and tap the colored boxes there and you can log right into your Clever account using your child's username and password. If you don't know your child's username and password, you should contact your teacher um, to get that information. So I'm going to log in to one of my students here. Phones are just a little bit different. And when you log into a phone, there's only one application in Clever that you're able to access, but really it's one of the most important ones. Um, so it's still good to get logged in. So once you're logged in like this, you can scroll down and you'll see an application called Seesaw, it looks like this. Seesaw is the only one that you can access from a phone, but Seesaw is the way that you can communicate to your teacher and have your child upload any work that they've been working on. Um, so in order to get Seesaw on your phone, you're gonna have to download it from the app store first. So you'll go back to your home button, go to your app store and type in Seesaw. You're gonna have a couple of options when you type in Seesaw. Usually the first one that comes up is the parent and family app. That is not the one that you want for your child to post. That is the one that you would use to connect your child's journal. But what you want today is the Seesaw Class app. It looks like that's actually a picture. It says Seesaw Class. This is gonna allow your child to actually post like they were in class. So once you have that application downloaded on your phone, you're gonna go back to your Google Chrome app and you're gonna click Seesaw from the Clever application. If you try to click the Seesaw app right on your screen when you download it, it's not gonna log your child in. So what you have to do is go back to Clever and click Seesaw and it should automatically log your child into their Seesaw account. Once they're on their Seesaw account, they can post pictures, videos, all kinds of different things showing their teacher what they're doing. Their teacher can then comment back and send voice comments um, to talk to your child. So it's a great communication tool. Again, if you are on a phone, it's still important to make sure you're getting logged in. This is the web address that you would type into Google Chrome. If you're having any trouble at all, please email me at acondon at or contact your teacher. Thank you.